What is up though, Fidgeteers? Synfiditree logging in for another Synfiditree presentation. This time around, we have a ring spinner coming all the way from Singapore. And I'm talking about none other than the Production Cube by One Stop Fidget. It was designed by Young An Un and produced by One Stop Fidget. Young An Un and Azure Yotul have been killing it in the spinner game. And I gotta salute those guys for what they do. Thank you for being in the spinner community. When you get this guy out of your mailbox, you'll get it in this nice little nifty carrying case, which is a super plus. The design is also marvelous. Uh, it gives it that metallic black feel to the overall look. Inside you'll get your ring spinner with a nice little card of authenticity stating all the information about this guy. I love, I love having authenticity cards. It gives it that nice little professional feel to it and in addition to your uh ring spinner you get an extra bearing in the pocket which is a nice little touch because these guys have been going for 12 dollars a piece so you're getting a value just there what can i say about this guy this guy is hefty when you get it out of the package you'll notice man this is one solid piece of steel I'm loving the overall design. Everything's nice and smoothed down, nice and polished, depending on the type that you uh, purchase. Let's take a look inside her, shall we? First and foremost, I gotta talk about the buttons. I love the buttons with the step down uh, feel. Uh, if you ask me, it looks like dartboards, and man, I love dartboards. So good job there. On the reverse side, you can tell this guy oozes quality. The chassis is made of 304 stainless steel. The bearing inside this guy is a 6703 stainless steel bearing. And I believe the bearing has a 17 millimeter diameter. And the bearing is held in place by a screw system that you just unscrew these guys and pop the bearing out and replace it with a new one. So that's always a nice touch. Easy for maintenance, not too rough. Overall, this guy comes in at 47 millimeters by 40 millimeters. And it has a thickness of about 10 millimeters. I'm loving the laser edge right there. That is a nice little touch. I weighed this guy earlier and this guy comes in at exactly 96 grams. So it's nice and bulky. I love the spin character of this guy. It has that metallic sound to it. Compared to other ring spinners that I've had the pleasure of spinning, this guy is the smoothest bearing I've came across. Maybe it's just a brand that they're using for this guy, but this guy oozes quality there. On a table spin, I was able to get about a minute 35, and on a vertical, I was able to break three minutes on this guy. So it's crazy to have a spinner that breaks the two extremes. This guy barely has any negative space. L let me break it down for you. As you can see, your finger placement will be here, right here, and in the corners right there, right there, right there, right there. And also, if you're pinch gripping it, you'll be using these corners right here and right here. The only drawback that I've seen with this guy is that it's a fingerprint magnet, but I'll take it for what it is for all the value and versatility it provides. And it's ring spinner configuration. I love how it seats very well on my finger. As I stated before, I believe this is 17 millimeters and it falls dead on on my sweet spot. It's between the first and second knuckle of the index finger. This guy is hefty, so after a while you will experience uh, finger fatigue, but that's just a matter of preference. If you don't like re heavy ring spinners, this guy won't be for you, but I'm all about heft in my spinners. This guy is just a joy to fidget with. You know how we do in this channel, we rate everything on a yay, nay, or in between. guys. If you're a spinner enthusiast, nine times out of 10, you, you have already checked the, this model out. 
You've seen it in Spin Space. You've seen it from my other fellow reviewers. And what I say is, what are you waiting for? This guy is a yay in my book. And talking about my rating system, if you guys have been following me more than one video, you'll notice that I've given in-betweeners and nays. And I have future nays in production. So my rating scheme is legit for those who question me. So once again, it's always a pleasure to bring you guys these reviews. I want to thank all the other reviewers that's covered this uh, little fellow. Uh, keep up the good work over there. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe. If you like this review, go ahead and smash that like button. We're going for 30 likes, you guys. 30 likes. Show me the love, guys. And I think that's all I have for you guys. Send for the treat, logging out, and I'll see you guys on the next review. Peace.